Hey YouTubers, exiled again. It's a video to show you that you can fix. Now for the average RC or that does not have a whole lot of money, and you break your helicopter, which it happens, say it's a helicopter like this, the Hummingbird, fixed pitch. You can't hardly find parts for these anymore, <clears throat> but if you break it, you can fix it. Now, see, a couple months ago, I snapped the main rotor, took some, my trusty M1100 G Mercury Adhesive, great stuff, you can pick it up at most hobby shops, and just super glued it back together, but it has to be balanced out. Even though it looks funny, as you can see, it's still balanced out perfectly. The other day, I broke my tail rotor. As you can see, there's a hairline crack. You can glue that back together. But, it's still going to be fragile. So what you do, if you take something, glue on the opposite side of it to help bridge the break. And yet, you have to balance it out again. So it still works. What we're going to do here is try to fly this bugger broken with the fixed parts. So, yeah, we're going to give it a whirl be its first debut on YouTube so we're gonna give it a whirl alright what we're gonna do here is give it a quick radio check motor okay seems to be working When you get so close to the ground, if you just kill the motor, when it gets about so far from the ground, blades collapse up, nothing's broke. So, 
I'm going to give that another try. I'm by far a professional pilot. Let's try. Well, <laughs> RC mounted, or con radio controlled mounted camera. Oh my gosh, it worked. Now that possibly could be gyro problems. Not sure. But run it up one more time. See? Kill blades. Kill motor, no problem. Let's see what was that. And the battery is dead.
that concludes gluing your helicopter parts and they still work as long as they're balanced out.